Hello and welcome to Trip TV Sports. I'm Pat Walter. Well, the air is finally cooled, and that means high school football is just heating up. Friday night marks the start of the playoffs, and that means there's plenty of matchups to watch in Tampa. The 9-1 Jefferson Dragons will travel to Largo to take on the Packers in a matchup full of big-time playmakers. But for the second consecutive week and the rest of the season, Largo will be without top running back Jarvis Stewart after being arrested last week. In his place, Largo will rely on QB Donovan Hale and his top receivers, Reginald Campbell and Raheem Harvey, who had three scores last week in their win over Countryside. On the Jefferson side, the Dragons will continue to go as their star quarterback and USF commit DeAndre Porter goes. Since losing to Armwood, the Dragons have put together six straight wins, outscoring their opponents 259-62, to a run that Coach Earl says was inspired by the Armwood loss. Sometimes when, when, um, when you face adversity like that, to be able to, to, to sit back and reflect um, and, and build from, from the mistakes that you made and realize the opportunity that we let slip through our fingers, um, that's inspiring to us. And, and these guys have really embraced that idea and are, are really looking forward to uh, these playoffs and being able to uh, you know, maybe facing that team again. And in Buccaneers news with running back Mike James out for the season, Bobby Rainey looks to see a bigger role this weekend, but he's not intimidated by the opportunity. He says he's going about it just the same way that he does in practice. Going into like uh, I've been going into practice, uh, doing my job and doing what I'm supposed to do. And uh, that's the same thing I plan on doing uh, the game is uh, doing my job and knowing what I'm supposed to do to help the team win. And for all you fantasy players out there, Rainey also said he thought he'd be a pretty good pickup for the rest of the season. I'll let you take from that what you will. Well, that's the news for now. For Trip TV Sports, we'll see you next time.